were some things about the last episode of time travel that really had the ring of truth. Just give us a speed. You'll never wear shoes faster than this. I want my money back. Are we back here for good this time then? <laughs> for good. I thought not ready. And there were other things you could just tell were a bit more doubt. But there was one thing the movie okay. that just had to be a lie. Sometimes there are some things that can't be explained Time doesn't stand still and there's nothing that stays Just the way we want it to be Things sure are changing around here yeah, a miracle we need right now Come out now. Don't tell me he's gone neurotic on us again. No, that plane scared him, that's all. Use this. Be a lot quicker than the dustpan. The combi! What am I gonna do? What? The combi. It just got stolen. Stolen? Yes. Before or after you got that cleaning duver? Jason! Just asking. Did you see who was in it? Yes, Michael and Harmony. Uh, Michael? But he can't drive. I'll try the other way. I'll try it again. It doesn't work, Harmony. Well, there's got to be something else. There's got to be some way of steering this thing. Maybe there isn't. Maybe the computer doesn't. That's it. Fred, Fred get us back to work. I'm very sorry, but I'm afraid I can't do that. Why not? It is beyond my program's capabilities to affect our navigational path once we have taken off. Oh. But that's stupid. Don't worry, we'll be okay. All we've got to do is hang tight. When I don't get home for dinner, Sam will have to tell Dad the truth. He'll call NASA, they'll send up a space shuttle. We'll be home in no time. A couple of days, maybe. A couple of days? What are we going to eat? We'll have stores here. What, but what if we can't eat them? Who knows what moonlings eat? Well, they eat our food, so it can't be that bad for us. Just don't expect it to look like our food. It could be anything. Wait. What if it's poison or something? No, these are okay. Sam bought them in the first morning they were here. Dinner is served. Thanks. <gasps> no. Doesn't he even have a phone? No. Why do you think I use yours all the time? I must report the loss of the spaceship. Who cares about your rotten old spaceship? Yeah, what about Michael? You should be helping him try and get back to Earth. What? Oh, look, oh. I know he's ganged up with Harmony and her dad, but he did give us a T-shirt back. After all, he's our brother. I know, I know. Don't worry, he's safe. Safe? He's lost in space in a ship he can't fly. Jason, don't overreact. The combi's on automatic pilot. There's only one place it can go. Got the answering machine on. It's Gamma Jane. Please pick up the phone. I've got to speak to the grandbaby. Please, is anyone there? My dear elderlings, today is the day we have all been waiting for. It is a day that will be recorded in history as one giant step for moonlings. On this day, Gamma
Spacesuits. Oh, they should be in here somewhere. What's that? What? That noise. It sounds like rattlesnakes. There aren't any snakes on the moon. What's that then? Struth. You see? It's okay. No need to panic. They can't hurt us on here. Now they'll just stay out there and... We've got to take off. How? We've got to do something. We're going to get eaten if we stay here. Look! There's a Rager! Just a bunch of moonlings with big rattles. Well, what do they want with us? Hey, it's all right. We're friends. Funny how we can hear them. Sound waves can't travel through empty space and there's no atmosphere here. I so... don't need a science lesson, Michael. This is serious. It could be an aberration caused by some sort of electromagnetic radiation. Can you just shut up? We've got to get out of here. What's happening? Jay must have told them we stole the comedy. We didn't steal it, it stole us. Who do you think they'll believe that? I still don't really expect to be friendly. Well, they're probably expecting the new grand baby. What do you think will happen to us? Nothing. As long as the door holds. Uh, uh, oh no. Uh, Sent for reinforcements. What are they carrying? Giant teething rings? No, they're crowbar rattles. We've got to get out of here. Crowbar rattles! <laughs> My fault! I'm trying, I'm trying! Fred, how do we take off? Just push the earth button. Force the earth button. Where's the earth button? I believe you earth wind is falling to the bottom. <laughs> Would seem sensible, don't you think? Mrs. Gamma Jane, please pick up the phone. I've got to speak to the grandbaby. There's been a lapse in security with the combi. Hello? Is that you, Gamma Jane? Yes, did you get the message? Hi, this is Jason. Look, none of this was Jane's fault, okay? Michael and Harmony just got trapped in the combi accidentally. So, when it gets up there, all you have to do is send it back down to Earth, okay? What are they saying? They said it's already on its way. And the grandbaby wants to talk to you. I'll probably get demoted over this. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Are you 
spare your babyness. You didn't really get demoted. What's wrong then? The grandbaby's just cut its third tooth. <laughs> that was close. Nah, I knew it would work out okay. You can't give up. Everyone's depending on you. I've let them down. Oh, we've only got two more powers to find. We'll never find them in time. What do you mean? That's the way losers think. If you want to be a winner, you've got to get out there and fight. Even when it looks like you've got no hope at all, you've still got to keep fighting. It isn't a game of cricket, Jason. You really think we can do it? Of course we can. We know the power of linguistic abilities in the bathroom. And the camera's all set up and ready to roll. <laughs> all we have to do is get Aunt Josie to go in there. Let's do it then. Right. <laughs> all right. Don't get depressed. We can still do this. All we have to do is find the last two powers. Have you set up the camera? Yep. So all we've got to do now is get her to work up a sweat and she'll go freshen up. No! How's it going? Well, not too bad. Want to go out and practice your driving? You know, whack a few one woods, get the blood pumping. Not this afternoon, maybe tomorrow. Oh, why not? Why let it go? It's feel like relaxing, that's all. Relaxing? You can't relax after all this exercise. No, I, I mean, you've got to warm down first. Oh, you stupid, Jason. I've just been pouting, that's all. Now, whose turn is it to cook dinner? Yours. Yours. Ooh. Really? Is it? Oh, better go and hop to it then. Do you think it'll work? Oh, it should. Everyone gets hot cooking dinner. And Dad said he wanted a mixed grill, so she's got to use the stove. But do you think it's going to make her hot enough? She's got a point. You can't take any chances. <laughs> Oh, I hate to admit it, but those locks at the nursery are flimsy. Even a child could break in. Children smart. You're telling me. That's why I can't leave this there. At least not till I get deadlocks fitted. Deadlock? They stop burglars taking things. And I don't want to lose this. Because it might be the last one I ever get to see. Unless you can remember who delivered them or where the invoice is. Come be! Come be gone! Come be gone! Hey, that's no problem. I can run you home. Jane! Jane! I guess you could show me the way. <laughs> Jane! Jane! Yeah, it's okay, Ralph. It's all right. I haven't left you. Jane! 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 What do you make of this? Looks like it can't be. Baby's rattles are not that big. It must be the tip of a meteorite. Can we get a look at the rest? <laughs> no, no, Jane would never leave you. No, 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 Gumby. Burglars took it. <laughs> Deadlock, stop burblers, take things. Well, yes. He is. But we can't put a deadlock on a car, Ralph. Deadlock. Anyway, they are bringing it back. The stove certainly heats up the room. Oh, does it ever. Oh, it's so hot in here. Why don't you go freshen up? Oh, I'd love to, but... Oh, I'll make sure nothing burns. Oh, thanks. Okay. What have you been up to, Jason? Oh, uh, nothing. 
Ah, uh, well, I, I thought it was getting a bit, a bit cold in here, so, so I, uh... Oh! Oh, you mean... Oh, I thought you meant... Oh, so you don't mean... I mean, what was this doing behind the ferns in the bathroom? I went to put Malapasio Estrangius down with the ferns, you know, so he'd have a bit of company, and I found my camera there hooked up to the door with a piece of string. Oh, and so naturally you think I did it. You did, didn't you? Why would I put a camera in the bathroom, Dad? You tell me. It was you, wasn't it? No. It wasn't, Dad. Honest. It wasn't. No, it wasn't. You see? Well, who was it then? Ralph. Ralph. But we'll tell him that he shouldn't be putting... Ah, uh, ah. Uh, you can go and explain it to him. But the camera stays here. Well, go on then. Ralph, my foot. <sighs> We came that close. Have you got another camera? Only a Polaroid? Oh, it spits the pictures out the front. We couldn't hide that. Wait a minute. Can you smell something burning? <laughs> I can't seem to get the hang of cooking. I was really looking forward to having a mixed grill. So was I. Still, why go to waste? No, not again. Sounds as if we've been under the flight path today. What flight path? Oh! <laughs> Let me show Dad. He can open the first privately owned space line. I can't wait to tell him. Have you any idea the trouble you've caused? It was an accident. He'll explain. Hi, Jane. I'm sorry if we raise false hopes, and I'm sorry that the grandbaby cut another tooth. But it's not fair to blame me. I've been through a rough time too. It's your own fault. You had no right to be in the combi without my permission. Yeah, what were you doing in there anyway? Hey, keep it down, will you? Ralph and I are trying to watch the news. Meeting in my room now, OK? You too. Has anybody seen the tin opener? I'm not, not baked beans. beans. Well, I'm sorry, but... Don't worry, I'll fix something. <laughs> not now, you won't. Dad, do you mind if I get some dinner? Huh? Oh, sure. Thanks, Mike. That guy could worm his way out of anything. No wonder he got away in a combi so easily. Yes. Excuse me, wait a second. Jane! There's something I have to do. Just wait till you get home, Miss Dump. You know what time it is. Sorry, but we found something. That I might have you... been worried sick. Next time you want to go running around like that, you can at least. What have you found? One of the moon things. Oh, 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 and I hope it's not something that's going to wear out. Oh, no, no, it's not one of the moon powers. It's even better than that. I knew it's we'd a... crack it. I knew it. We're going to be back in Dump Castle before you can say we're going to be back in Dump <laughs> Castle. As long as it is something with real money-making potential. Oh, it is. And you're it's... sure there are no hidden catches? No, no. All right, all right, don't keep me in suspense. What is it? This spaceship. It flies to the moon and back, so we thought, you know, you could sell joyrides to the moon. To the moon? Yeah. But it'd be a bit hard to keep something like that under your hat, though, wouldn't it? I mean, as soon as people tweet that I had flogged something off a bunch of moonlings, then I'd lose the monopoly. Anybody could do it then. Oh. No, what we've got to figure out is a way to use the spaceship without getting people involved. And I think I have it. Oh, yes, you can forget the passengers, sweetie. That's not the answer. You won't make any money just flying to the moon and back. <laughs> oh, yes, we will, sweetie. We will make a fortune. And it's all thanks to you. Oh, your dad is real proud of you, Harmony.
Good morning, Alpha Ralph. Okay, coast clear. First thing, we'll drive to the dump. Of course, we don't want them moonlings to see us blast off, do we? And we don't want them to see what our cargo is, do we? <laughs> Found it yet? No. That sounds like the combi. It is the combi! Come on, stop, you bastard! See? That looks like Dump. He must be trying to nick it. I thought he might. Aren't you going to do something? No. You can't just let him take it. Can I have some, please, Ralph? Jay! You can't just sit there and have breakfast. If Tom steals the combi, you might... Get... But he can't steal the combi, so it's okay. Why? What have you done? Have you drained the petrol tank or something? The combi doesn't run on petrol. It's powered by a cold fusion reactor. A what? A cold fusion reactor. It's the secret to interstellar space travel. Not that we use it that much. What, so what did you do? You turned it off or something? No, I just took it out. That's all. You took out a nuclear reactor on your own. Wouldn't you need a crane or something? No. The grandbaby designed it small. It likes things small. How small? That's the secret to interstellar space travel?